All right, welcome back to Fresh Living. I am here with nutritionist Ashley Palmer, and we are talking about probiotics. So, Ashley, first of all, what are probiotics? So, probiotics are basically the good bacteria that colonizes our intestines. And I know that sounds weird to think about, but actually all of us have different bacteria in our intestines and having the right ones are so important for good health. So probiotics, those are a good thing. Yes, now, absolutely. Where do we get probiotics from? So there's a lot of different sources. Some people will say get them from yogurt, some people will say get them from a capsule, but really getting anything that has the right amount and the right kinds of probiotics is what's really important. They can help with digestion, they can help with immune mm -hmm. health, they can even help with weight loss. Okay, so when we kind of talked about the different ty kinds, you can get them from yogurt capsules. Mm -hmm. You just mentioned that. Yeah. Is there a, a preferred source where you could get them from? What is better than the other? Well, the biggest thing is making sure that you're not. A lot of people think, oh, yogurt has probiotics. Let's just get yogurt. But the problem is, a lot of yogurts don't actually have live cultures, mm. so they don't actually have the probiotics that we need. And sometimes yogurt has a lot of sugar. Mm -hmm. um, in fact, one cup of sugar could use up your entire sugar allot allotment, according to the American Heart mm. Sugar wow. Association. Sorry about that. According to the American Heart Association. So how can we tell which yogurts are better for us than the others? I mean, so let me show you a good alternative. Okay. And this is a great product. I wanted talk about. It's Active Delights. It's actually not yogurt. It's actually ice cream. This is ice cream right here. Yeah. So not yogurt at all. No. no. And there are probiotics in this. Yeah. This ice cream actually has as much probiotics as one probiotic capsule. Really? Yeah. So just, you can eat an ice cream bar, but now is there a lot of sugar in these? No. Or? No. There's actually probably one fifth the sugar of a regular yogurt. So they're actually a really good healthy alternative if you want a cool summer treat. Yeah, go for this instead of the yogurt. Yeah. If, if folks maybe want to stay away from the, this and they want to go for the yogurt, mm -hmm. what, how do they know which one to pick? Um, what should they look for on the nutrition information? They look for on the label. Actually, I'll show you on this label here. It actually says 10 billion CPU. That's great. If you can mm. see anything that says how much it has in it, and even the kinds. This Hawaru type probiotic is actually really, really been proven by science to be very beneficial. So what other kinds of probiotics are out there? I'm going to actually try one of them. Yeah, please do try one. Um, there's, there's lots of different capsules. Once again, when you look at the capsules, you really want to make sure right. that they're the ones that have what, what they say is in them is actually in them. Okay. Yeah, so, and so you're looking for these things. You're saying yep. that yep. Polo Polo Polo. the right strain. Uh -huh. Yeah, which, and this, all this information mm. down here is the same sort of thing. Oh, this is really good. It actually tastes mm -hmm. good. Yeah. When I first looked at the right. books, I was like, there's no way this thing oh, tastes good. This is delicious. Yeah. So, so where can we get these? Any store. Any grocery store any in store. the freezer section. Active Delights. Yeah. Mmm, those are so good. Oh, you guys are going to be at the Health Expo this weekend as well. Yes, absolutely. I'll be talking about probiotics on stage. Perfect. There. So yeah. if you have any questions for Ashley, you can talk to her at the Health Expo. And otherwise, try these delicious treats. Active Delights. Available at any store. I'm going to finish my ice cream bar right here and get some good probiotics. We're going to check in with Debbie now.